don't know his place. Just out of vlog. Yeah. Right. Oh. I've just woken up from a three hour nap. And it started snowing. <laughs> in what? In the middle of April. Coming towards the end of April. I'm filming this on the 27th of, the, 27th of April. And it started snowing. There's some well nice reflections on that water. I didn't bring my camera though because I didn't think I'd be out. Too long. What a nice place to start this vlog. Anyway, right. I have not a lot to talk about. Oh, someone asked today recently how to use go how to oh, go for us how to use uh, scooters. So these are your light. These are your lights. Sorry, <laughs> that's off. On. Low beam. Full beam. Easy indicators, right, off, left, off, that's your horn, and that's your electric start, electric start, I use my electric start when my bike's been off for about like 5 minutes, maybe 10 minutes, so now to start your, to start your 50cc scooter, you need to turn it on at the ignition, I always like to let a bit of fuel in, put your choke on, there's your choke there, hold your back brake, Get your kickstart out, and then just, is he going to do this thing again he did over there? Yeah, he hasn't been on for that long, so I'm just going to do my kickstart. Come on, come on, it's been off like two minutes, come on. There we go. And I like to rev mine, until I hear it, like, until I hear it go, like, when it starts starting up properly, it goes, it goes Ram like that. I like to hear it go ring 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 sort of like a chainsaw. Okay, that should be okay, that should be okay. Right. It's just started snowing again. Look at the reflections, I don't know if you can see it. But there's sun rays and there's a really nice reflection on the water and Oh god, I don't bring my cameras at the best of time. Okay. I have a few things. Well, no, I have like one thing to talk about. My bad. Just look at these country roads. Oh, that's a thing. I'm gonna shut my helmet, my visor down fully because the audio turned out awful when it was like this. And you hear that wind. And you hear that wind noise. So I'll have it like this. Although it steams up quite a lot. So I'll open it every now and again. How does that how does that sound? I'm not sure, I'll have it open for a little bit. I need to do that trick again. Um ages ago I said a trick to um slide your visor out. I need to do it again. Look at these country roads, look how look how nice they are to just ride on. Sorry, this is like awful. I mean it's bad enough when you're breathing on it, but speaking as well. I don't know. Right, <laughs> I was on my YouTube feed the other day, and this video came up, it was Jeremy Kyle, um, if you're from America, Jeremy Kyle is practically the English version of Jerry Springer, is it, Jerry Springer, and um, it was this guy, and he, he, he tattooed himself, like his whole body, to look like a parrot, and he's had like surgery, like implants on his head, he had like stars. I'll, sh I'll show you a clip. All right, sir. Yeah. It is, it, it is, you would understand from my point of view, it's very, very strange. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's normal to me. See what I mean? Like, he looks, he looks intimidating. But then, as you watch, like, further on, he's actually a nice guy. And, like, it got me to think. Uh, like first impressions and stuff and the all the majority of the time first impressions don't matter like if you saw, like, you saw that guy in the street he'd be like yeah yo <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> avoid that guy you'd be like I, oh avoid him because obviously like we've seen him but if you actually like spoke to him and like got to know him you'd know that he wasn't all, like, that bad. Like, did you see how nice he was? He was saying how, like, he's, he's they're entitled to their opinion. 
and how he understands how it, how it would be weird, like, but it's what he wants to do. If people want to, uh, like, criticise, everybody got their own opinions. They're entitled to their own opinions, you know? Does it make you happy doing what you're doing? Oh, yeah. It makes Does it make you sad when people criticise you? No, you? no. Your life, you're happy, you're whatever. That's right. Like, if he wants to do it, just let him get on with it. That's what, like... <laughs> We all judge people. We all judge people. But like, we don't think before we do it. If you get what I mean. Like when I saw that video on my feed, I was like, "What the? What? Who's this? What is this guy doing? Like, what is wrong with this guy?" But then I watched the video, and yeah, I don't know. I don't know it just made me think. It made me think about it. I'm steaming up really badly. I might have to keep it open because I remember it not being too bad with it fully open. So yeah. Oh. I'm going a different way today. I don't know where I'm going. I think I'm just going on like a little ride out. Oh, it feels so good to be like doing this though. After my what a seven month break, eight month break, something like that. This is dodgy, dodgy, this corner. Look at the view of the train tracks. See, that make a nice picture as well. I just don't bring my camera. Oh. My bike's been playing up recently. Well, I say recently, I mean today. It's just been going really slow. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know why. It's just been going, like, ridiculously slow. It's starting to annoy me. And I don't know what to do about it. I've had a lot of, like, positive feedback on my recent videos and I love it <laughs> it's so good I really appreciate it. all your comments like I haven't had like one negative comment yet after like 43 44 something like that and did you all enjoy my setup video I tried to record it a bit differently like with my camera rather than solely on my GoPro let me know what you think to it what you thought to it sorry and if it helped if it didn't help then then let me know and I'll record another one I'll try and do it diff differently but if it helps, let me know. And uh, if you if you couldn't read the text at the start, it said I apologise for the not very good quality audio because it was quite late at night and it was very quiet, so I had to be quite quiet. So I had to be like as quiet as possible. That's why it's not like the best audio. Hold your horses, son. Hold them horses, yours. Bloody tractor drivers. They think they can get around you, like all the time, or they think they can run up you. Like, look at this guy, he's right on my tail. I bet he overtakes me now. I bet you. Bet you. And it will close as well. Well, they just think this. Like, they think they're amazing at driving. So they'll try and like maneuver. Oh, he's oh, he's so infuriating. That was a big word. I liked that word. But. Oh, it's just so annoying. It's ridiculous how they think they're like amazing at driving and they think they can get around you all the time and no. Like at least wait <laughs> at least wait to get to here. So you can actually normally overtake me. Because there's a lane for it. Like this guy. Look. See? At least he didn't risk anyone's life for it. Like this morning, right? It w wasn't a taxi, just a car. I was going up a hill, right, and this, this guy, in a, a duster, <laughs> I don't know if you've seen the advert, <laughs> he was in a duster, and he, like, he overtook me, like, he swerved right in front of me. He was, we were, he was overtaking me on a country lane corner, where you couldn't see around it, and he, like, he went round, and then swerved right back in front of me. Like, he almost clipped me with the back of him. And like I might be small, but I'm still here. You can still knock me off. <laughs> I'm still a thing. Like I'm real. You can't just like think, oh, I'll just go around him. I won't touch him and be alright. Because I'm still here, there is still a chance of a crush even though I'm really small. It just annoys me how like people underestimate scooters and motorbikes. Well not not necessarily motorbikes because they can go around anyway, can't they? They can they can like <laughs> Go on anyway, I could just head, but.
but Scoot was like that guy then. Did you see him? He just carried on. Didn't even slow down. If, I, if my back wheel would have gone then, and I'd have been on the floor, he'd have crushed me. I would have been gone. Like, he wasn't there, so I went. Right? He wasn't there. So I went. Therefore, he should have seen that I went, as he came around the corner, as I was halfway around committing the corner. And he should have slowed down, because I'm a scooter. I'm not a car or a bike. Or a motorbike, sorry. Just people don't think, man, you know what I mean? Just they don't think. This annoys me. Just annoys me, you know? Yeah, that was my topic for the day. The um, the whole the whole first appearances thing. Um, I don't have many topics to talk about. As um, I don't know. I thought I was going to come out and talk about that for the rest of the video, but that's gone quite quick. Oh well, I rambled a bit. I had a little rant. So I guess it hasn't been too bad. I know that car. That, that Fiesta with the red roof. I know who it is, I think. I'm pretty sure I'm not 100% though. Right, yeah, what is this about? <laughs> it's what? Mid oh. Pretty good place to park. Pretty good place to park, buddy. Spot on. If that car came on the corner that almost like took me out earlier and came around and didn't think about it. Straight into him. You never know. Right, it's what, the middle of April, the end of April, and it's snowing. Like, I got home from school. I rode home from school today. And it was, the sun was shining. It looked like a beautiful day. <laughs> it was snowing. Like, the sun was out. It was a really nice, like, blue sky as well. There was some blue sky, there were some clouds, and it was snowing. Like, like, what? <laughs> what? Right, I need to nip down here. Bike pulls up on that bit as well, it like, it like cuts out, well not cuts out, but it like, it's hard to start riding again if you got me. Oh. Right, I'll be about 10 minutes. I'll be back. I'm back. I was there uh, longer than expected, but that's fine. I don't know if you heard that, but <laughs> I got my bike. For 80 pound, <laughs> 80 quid for a scooter, and it's lasted me like my birthday. Oh, my, my, my birthday's just gone actually. My birthday is on the 18th of March. For those who want to know, buy me a present next year. <laughs> no, I'm joking. My birthday's on the 18th of March, and I got this for my 16th birthday. So it's lasted me just over a year now. I've, I've had one, one screw up. It's messed up once for me out of this whole time, but that was easily fixed, so that's fine. So eighty pound for a year's worth of transport is incredible, and it's like it's oh I think it's it's, it's frosting over, so I best be a bit careful. Oh I hate it when it frosts over and gets icy. It scares me so much, and it's bloody freezing. It's bloody freezing, I tell you. Oh god, it actually is quite cold, <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie. I go very slow up this hill. And it annoys cars because I go so slow. They even overtake me. When well, it's dangerous to overtake here because like, it's like a blind corner in it. But no, they still do it. All the time. Because they're impatient. I don't know if you can see that plane, can you see that plane? Looks quite low. Looks quite low for where I live. So yeah, this is um, my proper second motor vlog back because the other one was like part one of two sort of thing and two of two. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>